watching Big Jet TV. Hey, good morning, folks. Big Jet TV. I'm Jerry Dyer watching the midweek show live from London Heathrow. We're on top of the Hilton Garden Inn uh, once again. But this time, uh, it's been a long time since we've done this. Uh, we've got departures coming out right past our position. Uh, should, should be some spectacular stuff that we're going to be getting today. All the big heavy stuff is just about to start. I've got a 777 and a 747 lining up, 09 right. This is the southern end of the airport, and uh, we're going to bring you some great action today. We'll tell you all about how to become a channel member if you want to watch the rest of the show today. Uh, that's entirely up to you. But uh, for now, let's get on with the show. First now, look at this. Literally right on cue. Okay. So, folks, yes, that is Concord. Anybody asking? I understand that uh, either yesterday or on Monday, uh, the boys and girls um, at uh, London Heathrow's cleaning division actually gave her a wash. Uh, one, well, there's one of the, um, the fellas that I've seen uh, on the little washing wagons. I've seen... Uh, London Heathrow in the last few days. Here we go. Let's just get a pan shot example of this one. Here we go. Looks like United States. Smokey Joe. Coming straight back because I got a triple on the run. And then after that, we're going to switch straight back for this 747. Free view for 20 minutes, folks. Oh, hello. What was that? Flipping it. I thought that was an RTO for a minute. It was going so slow. Big old set of engines on the left. Wow, that's early. You're watching on Freeview right now on YouTube. Make sure you come in and say hello, folks. I'm going to come to your comments in a short while. Let this uh, 777 just go out over the top of us. because my mic is in Actually, I'll do that after this because the last thing we want to do is miss a 747 come on, be long, be long
Looks like she's westbound. So west to east, the uh, runway direction this morning, uh, zero nines. So he's making a full 180 degree bank turn as he now, wow, that steep climb out. It's incredible how these guys get to cruise altitude. 20, 30 minutes, she'll be, uh, she'll be very close to cruising altitude, maybe even earlier than that. So good morning. Let's just uh, throw it on a little bit of airport cam for you folks and do some shout outs. Shaker Maker, Benjamin McNally, Gunter, Caroline Blair, Chris Godwin, uh, Patrick Williams, good morning Trish, Drew McIntyre, Michael Forrest, Stephen Owers, Lee Smythe, uh, Wendell Burt, uh, v Liga Ligamsen, uh, good morning from London, uh, good afternoon here in Manila, good afternoon to you, uh, Arnie Hipkin, John Greaterex, good morning from uh, Blackpool, Nigel Dallas, Ian Child, good morning, Rory Woodhouse, gaming, um, Ian Child, Frank Van Dawson, good morning to you, um, yes, good morning, uh, somebody from China there, Howie, sorry, my apologies, or Japan, uh, Howie, good morning to you, giving us uh, information if you're uh, if you're on flight radar right now, folks, make sure you come in and uh, give us some information on um, on uh, on aircraft movements if you want. I always welcome. Oh, look at this rogue landing A380. So this is what we call a rogue, folks. Looks like it might be Qatar. Quite used to seeing this at this time of the morning. In fact, all, all the way through the day, you will get uh, rogue landings, especially uh, at this time of the morning when the heavy traffic's coming in. Boom! Wow! So nice crystal clear conditions this morning at London Heathrow. Seems like it might be uh, decent conditions all the way across the UK today. Terminal 4 we're looking at over there. Interesting to see an American Airlines uh, 330 parked up over there in that position. Uh, something we're not used to seeing very often. Um, that often, should I say, Qatar. A little uh, Qatar 320, is it? Uh, operating uh, for somebody under license, I believe. 777 just being towed into maintenance here. Craig Godwin, good day, Chris Godwin, uh, Rob Cartman, Triple uh, Seven, um, British Airways off to Tel Aviv. I believe that was one of the ones that just uh, went out just recently. Sorry if I'm a little bit late on picking up your comments, folks. Um, but obviously, as you can appreciate, there's a lot coming in. Um, Holly YT Ryanair landing. Really? Uh, don't think you'll find a Ryanair at Heathrow, my friend. Uh, Jetnet, good morning. Chris Little. Um, Nigel Dallas, Keith Cornell, Stephen Owers. Uh, let's flick over to Facebook right now. 
see what's going on there. Look at that beautiful big GE90 engine. Interesting with the reverser panels. Um, now you get a really good idea of the old RB211s on that 747 versus the uh, huge GE90, the new style turbo fan. Dreamland. Morning to all channel members, of course. Uh, quite a few channel members already sitting comfortably in the um, channel members areas, waiting for the show to start for them for their own very own show. If you want to find out all about Big Jet TV and what we do here. And uh, how to become a channel member, just head to bigjet.tv, you see the uh, website address right there on your screen. Interesting to see, that I picked up earlier on, um, beautiful Air China A350. Proper old school style retro livery, even though it is, it is their current livery, but always beautiful to see. So Dreamliner, now you see the uh, Dreamliner has a natural curve to the wing. But you'll see as she picks up speed, you'll see the uh, the wings start to flex upwards. this time. Good example of the condensation on the in on the intakes there. Okay, that 330 has been carted over here. Let's just uh, move this mic just momentarily. Right, let's 
get some comments up. Alrighty. Good morning from Norway. Uh, Magnar, good morning. Sue Smith, Steve Booth, uh, Simon, LFC Morgan, good morning from Leeds. Good morning to you. Uh, Bob Copsey, uh, Qatar 319 is part of the Qatar Amiri flight. Yes, we're aware of that. Uh, Bob, thanks for the info. Uh, but uh, we understand that she might have been uh, operating on behalf of... Uh, uh, another operator, we're not sure, 100%. Sandy Humby, um, that BA Dreamliner was off to Moscow, apparently. Thank you very much indeed for that, uh, Sandy. Matt Morris, Murray Benchfield, Roy Johnson, John Edge, Darren Attard. Uh, good day and good evening um, from what appears to be over there in Australia. Avianca's Dreamliner making its way out. Not sure if that's out for departure. I'd imagine uh, she may have just come in. Uh, Gerard Paul, good morning to you. John Edge from Bolton. Uh, Guru Talo, Talos, good morning from Budapest. Um, Peter Spencer. Mazar Yunus, good morning, and uh, RJ Rug Vaz tuning in from Southampton. Good morning to you, my friend. Wow, Martin Moss, uh, channel member, sat in departures at the moment, uh, heading out to LAX around about half past 11. What's, uh, do we know what aircraft is flying out, actually? Okay. So we're going to be here for at least an additional two hours on top of, uh, of what you guys are getting on Freeview. According to Flight Radar, um, apparently two Singapore slingers going out this morning, but we're not 100% sure about that. Patricia Turley tuning in from a sunny Armagh in Ireland. Uh, Brian Mitchell tuning in from Cornwall. Good day to you. John Edge, yes, it indeed it is a busy airport. In fact, to be honest with you, right now, this is, um, this is quite a quiet period, it has to be said. Is it a Dreamliner, is it? Okay. Uh, Mazar Yunas, good afternoon to you. Um, RJ Rogue Vaz, tuning in from Southampton. And uh, apparently, um, Darren Attard. Um, no Qantas, my friend. Uh, saw Qantas, the um, Qantas uh, A380 um, being towed to remote this morning. Uh, when I arrived, so uh, she's already she's already been and gone. If you know what I mean, she's already arrived. So no Qantas, I'm afraid, my friend. Lynn Garside, good morning from Gloucester. Uh, Abd Haviz, tuning in from Malaysia. Simon Mark Kelly, tuning in from Kent. Uh, love to see the classic Concorde still looking good in all its glory. Yes, paint. Um, she was cleaned. Uh, literally a couple of days ago, maybe even as early as yesterday. Sasha Hepner, Darren Attar, John Carter, Mikey Boss, good morning. Um, watching from Feltham down the road, literally watching them take off from here and then watching them go over while on uh, tachograph. Love it. Wow. Fantastic. Tachograph. Interesting. Good 
ones to watch uh, from that position from places like Felton, obviously, uh, is um, are the big heavies banking out John Carter. Terry O'Neill. Um, 30, SQ305 out at 9.25, uh, 380. Well, there we go. A lot more big action to come, big jet action to come right the way through another two hours. Uh, we're running out of time on Freeview, unfortunately. Never like to say it, but obviously our, uh, our channel members do come first. We will be here for another two hours. Joshua Michael just cannot get enough of this channel. Well, I hope you're here, mate, um, because we are now going to be uh, switching over um, to our channel members, folks. It seems to go too quick. 20 minutes is a, is a short period of time when you're banging through all these aircraft like this. So thanks a lot for tuning in. Really appreciate your company. And... Um, Watch out for this Saturday. Um, in fact, um, we will be at an air show this Saturday down at Tidmouth or Tynemouth, whichever way you like to pronounce it. Um, but more information coming up on that uh, later. Just check out our Facebook page for updates on that, as well as obviously the ticker on the website. Bigjet.tv is where you need to go. If you're a new member or if you joined recently or if you're joining this morning, make sure you come in and say hello. Uh, we won't bite, folks. We're a great bunch of people and they will welcome you with open arms. Uh, feel free to comment or just sit back and watch the show whichever way you want to do it. But thanks very much for tuning in. We're now going to switch over to our channel members. Okay, Jilly, cabin doors to manual, hit it. <laughs> 